Hey guys, how's it going? I'm Bell here, and uh, I'm doing a tutorial on how to make your own Daisy private server for 1.7.5.1, I think. Yeah, for the latest Daisy. Even. Alright, so I did not make this. It was made by a guy called Ponzel. He's like a really great modder and shit. Where to his YouTube actually? This is him here. He's made all these videos. Um, I will link him because it's obviously his video, and I give props to him. So props to him. Alright. So next. Alright. So after that, or you, there'll be a link in the description to go to this. This is pretty much all the server files. So you just want to hit zip. And it should download. I've already got it. I've already got it here, so I don't need to download it. Okay, once you've got that downloaded, open it. Then you should see Daisy Private Server Master. Open that. You've got all the files in here. That's your config. Alright, so next, what you want to do is going to go to your Steam folder. I've got mine on the shortcut. But you can find yours going C, Program, Steam, Steam Apps, Common, and Armity. Okay, now all you need to do is drop and drag them in there. I've already got them in here, as you can see here, and shit. Um, so I don't need to do that. I can delete that actually. Alright, so once you've done that, you should see a file called CFG Daisy. Okay, now what this is? This is your hive. Um, this is like your server file um, information. Like. I've got mine set to that and shit like that. Right, so host name, type in what you want. Mine's Daisy Hunger Games because me and my friends were doing the series that didn't really work out. So just keep that. Change your password. Uh, pass admin passwords. Don't need to bother with them. Welcome message. You can change these. Um, I just set this to. Why not? Um, so that to that. Okay, so you can set the max players. Mine's at 10, but I'm going to set that to 20 actually. So you can change that. Keep. Uh, you don't really need to bother about that. In game settings, you can disable um, VON, which is um, like you can talk in channel and shit. Uh, you can also um, change the codec quality for it. You can also turn off Battle Eye by simply doing one or zero. I've got it off. Um, here is your template. Uh, it only comes with one template, which is Daisy Cherneris. But you can download other templates like Utez, uh, Takisan, Taviana, and shit like that. All you need to do is right click rename copy and just go here and then paste it and that will have the map utez but i'm going to keep on generous just for the video and then you can click save and that's done all right so next what am i doing hold on all right sorry all right um i think that's it is it Oh yeah, here's your Daisy. Um, there's just like some stuff for for the actual map itself. You don't really need to play around with them. Um, I think that's it. Okay, so what you want to do after that is you should have a file at start server. I've got mine set here, so I'm just going to click that. And now you see it should run this and then it will come up with that starting um, my SQL please wait 5-10 seconds yep launch created by Ponesaw All right. okay so as you can see it's on here now I'm just going to minimize these and I'll be back when I'm in the game Okay, so as you can see, um, launch your armor or your daisy. 
go to multiplayer you can either type in the filters um, what you named it or you can either go to LAN and it should be here just double click it type in your thing yada 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 type in your admin password as you can see bonjour bonjour even whatever, however you want to say it I'll go change all these after so none of you guys can get on my server just close these Alright, I'll wait to turn this in the game because it takes ages. Alright, okay, so as you can see, I'm in game, just gonna turn that down. You see, I'm on my server now. So you start off with nothing. Um, Alright, I'm just gonna go ahead to a place, show you that loot spawns, etc. Okay, I'm back. Alright, so we're up northwest. Um just gonna go ahead to the barracks see if any loot spawned. Alright, uh, where are the barracks actually? Because I have no clue. Oh you don't have a bloody clue. I've been playing this game for like fucking ages. Oh they're in there. I do have zombie proof I did turn zombie proof on, but I'm not going to tell you how I turned it on, just because I couldn't be asked to encounter zombies. Alright, so uh, we'll go see if loot spawned in. Yep, as you can see, loot has spawned in. And there's a bench in the way, which is always good. Get the fuck over. So as you can see, EpiPen. Some mags, what mag are these? DMR and 2M107 mags, see? Um, let's try to find a gun. Alright, okay. Alright, I'm just gonna teleport somewhere. Teleport somewhere to find, trying to find a gun to show that guns do actually spawn loot, or do spawn. Sense. Okay, so alright, I'm back. Um, head to the barn in Electro. Going to see if there's any guns. Okay, so straight away found a crossbow. Which is like the shittest gun, but still. Alright, let's go see what else we can find. Oh, zombie. Take bandage, nah, we're good. Alright. Oh, shit, son. Okay, so we found probably my favourite, like, my fav my favourite gun in, like, the whole game, which is the CZ 550. This gun's just incredible. Uh, yep, yeah, so, there you go. Loot that spawning. How nice it looks. Boom. Yeah, so uh, that's how you install a Daisy 1.7.5. No, 1.7.5.1 1 server. Uh, if you could hit the like button and maybe subscribe, that would be appreciated. Okay, that's it.